I want to give a little context to measles. Prior to 1963, if you were under the age of 15, the vast majority of individuals contracted the measles. It just before the, the vaccines, people often contracted measles. A little dig a little deeper, that's three to four million cases a year of measles in the United States. And of those, 48,000 on average a year required hospitalization. And on average, over 500 deaths a year attributed to the measles. Measles facts include it's a highly contagious infection. Young children are at particular risk. There are short-term complications from measles, including pneumonia. Long-term complications, including hearing difficulties or deafness in a percentage of cases, and also in a percentage of cases, long-term intellectual or cognitive deficits attributed directly to the measles infection. There are deaths still associated with measles, one to two individuals per thousand cases. And in those individuals, the most likely cause is because they did not receive the vaccination. Measles, believe it or not, was considered eliminated from the United States as recently as the year 2000. But where have we gone since then? Unfortunately, we've become a bit lax and percentages of people have decided to opt out of getting vaccines. And when they opt out, they put themselves at risk for getting infection. So the outbreak scenarios we're seeing presently are directly related to individuals not getting vaccinated. So if you're not vaccinated, I already pointed out, this infection is highly contagious, you're going to likely get infected. So the surest way of protecting yourself against measles, get vaccinated.